Hey friends, welcome or welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida. On Mondays, we do our weekly check-in, paycheck to paycheck. And this is how we start our week with our intentions set on our bills for the week and what we have to pay. So if that is something that you would be interested in, stay tuned. Okay, friends, so we're going to just hop right on in. I just want to make sure I'm using a, the right one. I'm going to open up a calendar to this week. You guys, I've been doing, if my desk looks kind of a mess, I've been working on a 100 envelope order and I still have more to go. This is just half. Um, I took a day to cut. Um, a day to laminate so I have all of these I have like 12 more to do I was hoping to get them out today but I forgot I had a customer so I had to go into work so I'll have these done by tomorrow so I'm getting my paycheck to paycheck up just a little late so I hope you all don't mind so this week I'm just grabbing a pen let's see we are on the 13th through the 19th and this is the third week okay so y'all i'm gonna be honest with y'all this week is rough it's looking rough <laughs> it hasn't even started today is just monday but it's looking rough but y'all my hair <sighs> it's looking a little rough. I'm just going to put 300 down for hair. Um, Shopify, it's not making no noise. <laughs> it ain't making none. So I'm just going to put 20 and then miscellaneous, which is if I decide to do Instacart, um, like I said, husband give me money um, and my Etsy. My Etsy actually is getting a little, you know, action so i'm going to put 50 down for etsy so we have 370 dollars for the week okay i said i was going to start skipping this part because i didn't know if you guys wanted to see this and i didn't want to drag it on but on the 15th first day of um the 15th today is actually my bff's birthday but we have T-Mobile, which y'all, it, it just ain't gonna get paid. I don't even know why I'm writing it down. But I think it is like $206. We have Capital One. And the minimum amount is $25. That'll probably be all that I can pay. I'm actually thinking about going into um, some of my sinking fund envelopes, like my challenges to pay for this T-Mobile, because like I said, this week is so, so, so short. This is the week where also all of my other credit card, the other half of my credit card bills are due. So honey, I'm over it at this point. On the 17th, we have Citibank. I believe Citibank is at $30. And then Barclays, oh Lord. Barclays, um, it's like 84. I'm gonna go ahead and put 85. I have no clue how this stuff is gonna get paid. Um, also, my car note is due on the 20th, or well, that's a Monday, which is the following week. But I'm thinking I need to prepare for it this week, which I don't know. I just don't know. Y'all, I just don't know. <laughs> That's all I got. I just don't know. And then booth rent is 200 I don't know if I'll have anything to stuff. If anything, I'll probably be stuffing my tips, but I won't know those until the week is over. So booth rent is due on the 18th. So let me do a little calculating. five hundred and forty six dollars that is our total and if we subtract that from the 370 we're at negative one hundred and seventy six dollars 
Now, again, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I just, that's all I got. I don't know how this stuff is going to get paid. I don't know. Uh, like I said, the T-Mobile, it has to be paid because this is like a, a payment arrangement. So I may have to go into, again, those challenges and pull out some money. Um, I've already, because I had, oh, some afterpays. I didn't even include the afterpays. Um, one is like $15. And one is like eleven eighty seven. So let's take the five forty six. I always forget something. So those are just coming out. So I was saying that I already took money out of my self care to pay for those little things because like after I stuffed envelopes, there was nothing. There was just nothing left. And I just, not even kind of like to get me to the weekend. And so, and I don't like using credit cards to survive, but that's where I'm at. So I'm like, it doesn't make sense. Like if I have the money, you know, technically, but all right, let's subtract this 370. Wait a minute. Hold on. So we are negative two hundred and two dollars and eighty two cents. And I don't want to like jump the gun and take my money out of my envelopes to cover this week. But literally, y'all, I only have, like, two customers. Now, I could do my Instacart, but I don't see me getting $200. But then it could happen. Um, and now I'm kind of wish I would have did maybe DoorDash because Instacarting is a little rough on my body. But so there's nothing to fill over here. Not yet. You all won't see if I'll be able to stuff anything until Friday. Um and we'll see i'm also thinking about opening up my saturdays again to um clients to see but nobody is asking for saturday so that's reason one of the reasons i'm not offering it so you know at this point i just don't know like i said but today i said a little prayer i just said lord you know what i got in front of me but you always provide so we'll see how it go um if y'all want to check in like next week to see how this week went bill wise um let me know and i'll do a um close out and let you know how this week went but y'all that's all i have for today i literally do not have anything else like i said so i'm going at first when i was making these just a little chat y'all let's close this up just a little chat as i was making these envelopes like i said it took me a day <clears throat> to cut them and i said i know what i'll do i'll cut them get them all even because I needed to figure out a system. And because it's taking me forever to do mine. I still haven't finished mine, but I'm working on the order. So I said my system would be to cut them first. Because that took me a couple of hours. Just to cut them, get them the right size. And then, so today, I laminated them. Laid them in their place. Laminated them all. And then started to cut them. And then I was going to add the numbers. So it'll take me about two days to do it. But as I was cutting them, I said, ain't no way. When I finish this order, I'm not going to do anymore. Because <laughs> it's very time consuming. But I think I'm just going to, you know, try to figure out a faster system. And I guess because someone was paying me, I'm getting through it faster than I would, you know, think I would. Especially for myself. Like I said, here go mine. And I still haven't gotten through them. So... Um, that's that. And I started to give them half of mine just so I could cut down the time. But I said, no, I'm going to do them and um, see how they come out. And I'm loving them. Um, so if the young lady is watching who placed this order, it's only one. These are your envelopes and they are coming along so well. And that's another thing. Like me doing stuff for everybody else. I'm a slight perfectionist, but for myself, I really don't care. So that's what takes me so long. And kind of generally stops me from doing a lot of things because I want it to be perfect. And sometimes things just ain't perfect, you know. 
But y'all, that's all I got today. Thank you for listening to my ramble. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video, today's paycheck to paycheck. Have you done your paycheck to paycheck? If today is your first time watching any of my videos and you enjoyed today's video and you would like to see more from me, please do me a favor, hit that um, subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.